Hello, everybody. Today I'm here with Disney Mirrorverse, and we're going to be trying out the new Scrooge McDuck event. And you can see here, these are all the rewards you can get from spending your, uh, um, whatever the canes are that you get from the event. And you can see, I'm going to be able to get Judy Hopps and Scrooge McDuck from this. Unfortunately, Goofy is not in here. Uh, that's not a great way for me to unlock Goofy right now. Uh, I'll, I'll try, he's in the mission shop, which they did take down due to some... Um, bugs with it but with this event today we're gonna be unlocking Scrooge and Judy Hopps at least at with one star um, if I can afford some more expensive ones I will do so but uh, this event is gonna be around for six days I was kind of excited to do it I'm doing it right after it came out uh, we're also waiting for the Disney's battle mode update right now but obviously this video will come out after that I'm not sure when I'm gonna upload this video but uh, it will be fairly soon so we're going to be just going through. It shouldn't be too difficult or anything. Um, let's put in Scar. We just want a tough team here. I probably won't be switching out my characters all that much. Um, so let's just go into it here. We're going to switch over to Scar. And yeah, I think you can just like auto win these levels after you beat them and get some extra canes from it so I'll probably end up doing that um, for for this episode I want to skip cinematic animations I've known this was a thing for a while I usually just like to keep it on because it's nice to watch, but uh, we're not going to be using any new characters today, so I don't think it's worth keeping it on. And I I'm excited to finally get Judy. We never had her before. We had Goofy and we had Scrooge, so... Um, we at least know what their designs look like. Okay, so it is kind of interesting to watch these animations without like the big um, cinematic version of it that makes any sense like we got to see the bear arrow from Merida fly up and then come back down on the enemy which you don't see when the animation actually happens okay so I just realized yeah I need to bring in what they want me to bring in so I don't bring in a support guardian the, the previous one I'll do once I'm done with the video, I'll go and get three stars on it. I think there's a reward for getting three stars on every level. So, okay, and we're seeing the golden uh, variants of enemies come back, which I don't think we've seen yet in the game at this version. Uh, it was in the old version for sure. But uh, it looks like it's just this enemy for right now is gold. I don't know if other characters can get the gold, but... All right. So yeah, I guess there is a kind of a different animation we get to see with this. Um, I'm realizing now I I thought this event would maybe be a little bit more exciting. <laughs> I, I know I was like, super excited for it, and then when I saw what the event actually was, it's just like ten levels, basically just a grind fest. Um, I'm not so excited anymore. I'm just excited to get the new characters. Maybe we'll go and unlock Scrooge in this one and bring him in in the event and then um, when we're done with Scrooge or then at the end of the, the video we can go and get Judy and bring her in. For the next episode. What? Why am I only getting two stars? What is the other requirement? Oh, I have to have a support on my team. I thought I was saying don't have a... Oh my gosh. Okay. How many of these? Is there a quick way to see how many of these I have? Man. That is really hard to get those. Okay. Let's keep going then. Maybe we won't be able to showcase Scrooge during the video. If they barely give me any canes for beating these. 
So we need to bring a support in. Is what they're telling me. You can bring in Jack, why not? I blow him up. Each of my characters have blown up a little bit uh, higher than they were in the previous video. And, um, what was I gonna say? Oh, I, I, I was gonna save up some materials to upgrade the new characters again as well. Honestly, I don't think it's really gonna matter. I get a bunch of upgrade things to upgrade my characters with like all the time, so I really don't need to save up. But uh, yeah, uh, Scrooge and Judy are going to be like way under leveled at the beginning. And I assume, looking at how many canes they give you per level, I probably won't have that much um, to buy the more expensive ones. So I'll probably just have them both at one star. If it's really hard to get canes and I can only get like one character, I'm gonna get Judy because like I said, I haven't gotten her before. I'm really excited to see Judy. Um, I got a comment from one of my most frequent viewers, Patrick, who was talking about the camera angles and how it's kind of awkward to um, to I mean he, he's never played the game but it looks awkward from his point of view and it, it kind of is especially when there are a lot of enemies on screen and you can't really see some of them you kind of have to just like walk around and look for an enemy I mean it does show you on their like character screen or like on the little icon at the top there's a little arrow showing you where they are but I mean that's not as intuitive as it could be I mean the benefit of the cell before was that you could see everything on screen pretty much at all times and now you're focusing on one character which does make you feel more like you're playing as this character but um, the, the downside is that you don't get to see everything on screen so also, is every fight against Scrooge, has that been the consistent? Because that just makes the event even more boring. I mean, I guess they're probably... Yeah, so there are two bosses here, but still. And we should use some of these power-ups. Not power-ups. Um, special skills, I guess. Merida's dead. Now we just wail on Scrooge for a while. We did get another golden enemy here. I guess that's really the only new thing in this event so far, is the golden enemies. Which we'd already seen in the previous iteration of the game. Yeah, so I need to get my um, expectations in check or I don't need to be hyped for future events, I don't think, if they're going to be like this. There's not even like a story involved. It's just play through these levels, get all your um, canes, and then uh, go back through later and keep auto-playing them with all your energy to get a bunch more canes, which is pretty boring. But I mean, it's not boring that we get to unlock two new characters. Just the way of doing it is pretty boring. I'm trying to, I guess I should switch, let's go to Jack, I've been using Baymax the whole time. I just like playing at, as Baymax the most out of these three. Like with Jack, I'm not going to get close up in person while I'm literally just shooting. I am at an advantage in this event because I've played this game before and I have all my characters pretty high leveled right now. Um, I wonder how the final fight is going to be, but I, I am at a little bit of an advantage. But I assume most people that are playing this event right now probably had the game um, in the previous version as well, so also were able to get their characters a little leveled up. 
The Scrooge is really uh, healthy, I guess you could say. See, this is why I want to fight his Baymax. So we're going to kill this gold guy quick, and then we're going to get close and personal. Maybe we should stun him. Uh-oh. Baymax might die. I'm trying to... what? Um, did I heal? Oh my gosh. That is super frustrating. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go back through a lot of these levels. And, uh... Get three stars on them. Oh wait, I got three... Oh, they allow you to get one... It lets you have one enemy die, or one character die. That's good, I guess. We've almost collected a thousand canes, is that what it said? Oh, do I have enough to unlock Scrooge? Hold on. No. I do. I think we should do it. So, here is Scrooge in the game once again. We can bring him in as our support guardian. He's probably going to die, but that's okay. Let's claim these while we're at it. What was the other thing? Oh. Oh, so we get a bunch of canes for these. Wait, no we don't. What? Okay, whatever. Um, let's go back in here. We might run out of energy before we're able to complete this event. But I have some things to give me some more energy, so. We're going to go in here. We will attempt to bring in... Oh, actually, sorry. I really need to upgrade Scrooge at least a little bit. We'll level him up as much as we can. Only level 9, that's okay. We'll rank him up. And we can equip. We might as well upgrade these as well. And equip both of them. Too bad we weren't able to get him all the way to level 10, but... I'm not going to upgrade him a second time. But there we go, we have Scrooge. Wait, what? Where did we get Judy? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, I guess we have Judy now. Where did we get Judy from? Was she from one of the achievements? I didn't even notice. I'll have to watch the video back. Okay, well it just gave us a two-star Judy somewhere. We're not going to showcase her today, but we will showcase her in the next video. I promise you. We'll go through another story chapter, probably a hard version of the second chapter. But we're going to bring in Scrooge now. When did we unlock Judy? <laughs> she must have been a reward for one of those uh, achievements I claimed or something. Like maybe collecting a thousand Scrooge tokens gave me it? I don't know. It's crazy. Oh, shoot. Oh, and we want to switch over to Scrooge. We're going to... Just for a second. We want animations on so we can see what his looks like. And look at how little health he has compared to everyone else. But he is arranged uh, in a way he shoots, so... I'm pretty sure that animation is different. I've never seen that. And he gains focus, it looks like. And I like his, uh, his charged animation. He, like, swings at almost like a golf ball. It's like a golf swing, basically, and uh, it's the the character he's targeting. It's a cool animation. Let's do this again. Do we heal at all from this? Oh, we do. Okay, so we get focus and we heal. That's very good. I'm going to switch back to having the animations off. And then keep going. And then we can see... <clears throat> we can see what 
Scrooge's animation looks like when it's not cinematic. So yeah, Scrooge shoots with his cane. He swings up at the ball with recharged attack. Um, in a way, he's like a ranged character. I guess we're also fighting him here. He's going to be probably pretty strong. Or maybe he's weak and then there's a bunch of different characters. No, he looks pretty strong. Um, so we're going to use that. He can stun you. And then we're going to want to do Scrooges as well. And uh, make sure you do this quick as well. You probably want to use Baymax as quickly as well. He might die. Yeah, look how much health the Scrooge has. We can heal quick. My healing isn't, isn't as good as someone else's could be. Yeah, maybe I should have brought in a uh, Scar. I don't know. Uh, I'm a little worried. Because if Baymax dies, uh, Scrooge might also die. If Scrooge is targeted, he'll probably die. Luckily, he hasn't been really targeted at all. We could really use the enemy Scrooge to die right now. Uh, this is kind of going to be a showcase of the Scrooge, I guess, which I guess is fitting for the Scrooge event. But uh, we'll probably bring him in in future levels as well. Like maybe when we do Judy, we'll bring Scrooge in a few times. It is unfortunate I wasn't able to get Goofy yet. Uh, in my experience, it seems like you barely get any mission rewards, and they wanted you to get a lot to get Goofy, so... We're going to bring in Scrooge maybe one more time, and then we'll go back to the more experienced characters, because Scrooge is really weak, and it's hard to uh, do a lot with him. Let's let's use Baymax this time and then just have Scrooge on the team. And uh, we're just going to kill this golden guy right off the bat. Oh, is someone healing? It's not good. Oh shoot, we're getting beat up here. Yeah, this event might end up getting pretty tough here towards the last couple of battles. Luckily, it... Getting three stars allows you to uh, lose an enemy, or uh, an ally. So, it may make it a lot easier to actually three star all of these yet. And we're, we're still doing okay with Scrooge on our team, but I don't know how long it'll last. Oh man, the, the sun is coming in through the window and it's making my screens really dark. I'm having a hard time seeing. Yeah, um, Baymax is getting hit pretty bad. I probably need to continue to heal and everything. You can stun Jack. And then hopefully kill him quick. There we go. And so far hasn't crashed either, which is really nice. We got this final encounter. Scrooge has been the hardest part of these encounters so far. Uh, let's see what happens here. I can do this quick. Wow, that enemy is out right away. Um, Baymax is almost definitely going to die here. Oh, Scrooge is... Oh no, this is bad. We might lose this. We didn't stun Scrooge either. I don't think Merida can take him on her own, honestly. Uh oh. Baymax is going down any second. I don't know how he's still alive right now. Come on. They're both stunned. <laughs> how is Baymax still alive? Look at his health bar. <laughs> Come on. 
Seriously, what the heck? Baymax is... Is he... Okay, he's finally dead. I was so confused. He re oh, what? I was hoping that would hit Scrooge. We can kill him, right? Merida, you got this? I feel like we can do it. We're definitely not going to get three stars from it. Okay, so we did beat it. Cutting it very close, using... We lost Scrooge as soon as he started getting attacked. Uh... Okay. Game kind of slowed down a little bit there. We're going into this one, taking Scrooge out. I'm sorry, Scrooge, but you're just not going to cut it. Yeah, we're getting to the point where my highest level characters are at the level that the um, game is suggesting, which means the level's definitely ramped up in difficulty. I'm not sure if, how far I'm going to... Like, I don't even know if I can beat the final level or not. I, I sure hope so. But we'll go as far as we can. If we just can't beat the final one, then that's just that. We can bring in different characters, I guess, and try different strategies out. Uh, uh, we just found out about a new character in Disney Heroes Battle Mode, and it's very recent. Um, it'll be a little less recent when I upload this video, but um, I really want to talk about it, so I'm just going to talk about it here. If you don't want to know characters coming up, then skip like the next couple of minutes. I'll talk about it for a little bit. But we're getting uh, Dr. Draken. I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm sorry, I haven't watched Kim Possible in so long, but from Kim Possible, we're getting another character, which is so crazy to me. Uh, just because it was so... It took forever to get Kim Possible, and now all of a sudden we've got another character coming from the series. And I personally would love Shigo a lot more than Draken. Um, they're both villain characters. It's also crazy that we're getting a villain character, but... Uh, uh, not only a villain character, but from uh, a show or a series that we weren't even sure was going to come to the game for a long time. So it's very exciting. And... Um, what was I going to say about this? Oh, I really, really, really want Phineas and Ferb characters. And it gives me hope that if we got Phineas and Ferb characters, that uh, we would get Goof, or sorry, Doof, Dr. Doof and Schmertz as well. But I don't know. Anyways, Bamex is going to die any second once again. There he goes. I really don't know if we're going to beat this. Um, these battles are getting really tough. Oh no. I don't think Merida can do this by herself. And she's getting beat pretty bad as well. Just look at how much uh, health Scrooge has though. Like I don't know if I can beat him like that. And I'm trying to like get out of the way but she will not move where I'm telling her to move. Yeah I don't think I can beat Scrooge like this. We can sure try. I just keep like dodging his attacks, maybe. Uh oh. Yeah, I don't. Should I just kill myself? I don't know. <laughs> I feel like this is just not gonna work. But we can keep trying, I guess. Maybe range is the best way to go here. Or maybe Merit is really good. <laughs> She's surviving. I mean, it's pretty easy to dodge his attacks, I guess. Yeah, we killed Scrooge, well. I'm genuinely surprised that we're going to beat this. I don't know what to do differently. I feel like Baymax is a pretty good character to bring in. 
Oh, I thought it crashed for a second. It's definitely going to crash at some point here, I just don't know when. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to get three stars on these, really. Also, it's not letting me click continue. Oh, there we go. Yeah, the game is having a really hard time loading right now. Um, is it even, like, going to be possible to go into this level? I have no idea. It's not showing me how much power it wants me to have, either. Um, it's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to look at this. The game is having such a hard time loading this right now. So we can definitely get a one star Judy if I just go back through the ones I've already beaten and uh, auto win them and get some more canes. But uh, I don't know about completing this event. I say that we just finish here, because I really don't think it's even worth going to those final levels. You saw how close that last one was, and those were my highest level characters. I don't think I'm going to get any farther. I may try it on my own, and if I beat them, then I can do it in another video. But uh, that's all we're going to do for today. We'll showcase Judy and probably Scrooge as well in the next video. So, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you then. Goodbye.